Hi, everyone. <laughs> so hope everyone is doing good, staying safe. Thank you so much for being a part of this Together We Set event. I'm Alicia from Ground Zero in Singapore, and I will be meeting you in your afterburn for today. So we will start totally in about six minutes. So we still have some time to stretch it out. Hope everyone's doing good. So usually I teach resistance classes at our studio space in the Central Business District, but this is our studio for today. Yeah, you can see me well right over here. I have a small garden up here. So yeah, we will start in about five. Yep, all right, so for people who are new or if you have not done any class class workout before, before this we had Sydney. So Sydney was on a couple of hours before and now we will be going through a total body weight only program which uses varying intensity levels as well as different modes of exercise. So hope you guys are ready, make sure you get some awesome music on. <laughs> hey, hi everyone. All right, so as you guys are setting up, make sure you have some water nearby as well as some awesome music. So I want you guys to pull up your favorite playlist, whether it's on Spotify, or on iTunes. I think music makes a big difference in working out. So I want you guys to put on your favorite tunes to make sure you have a kick-ass session. All right. So another quick reminder, if you guys are getting set up, the only thing you need is your towel, a yoga mat, so you can set it up right behind you over here. And that's about it. Oh, and don't forget to pull up your music. Oh my God, awesome. Oh, I love San Diego. I spent like six months there last summer. It was so beautiful. I love it. Right, so if you guys are wondering about any equipment that you need, it's all body weight, so you don't need any equipment, but for some exercises, so let's say you want to make it a bit more intense, you can grab a weight, so whether you have a dumbbell, a backpack, whatever, but I encourage you guys, you can just use body weight, you still get a really good workout. All right, so cool, everyone's tuning in from all over the world. Nice. All right, so for everybody who just joined, welcome. I'm Anisha from Ground Zero here in Singapore, and I will be leading you in today's afterburn workout. So all you need is a towel, your yoga mat, as well as to have some water nearby so you can take a break in the team. Make sure you stay hydrated throughout the workout. And don't forget to pull up your music, Spotify, iTunes, whatever you want, and turn it up. And get set up. Gonna just see if everyone can see me. All right, looks good. <laughs> All right, just a few more minutes to go. So, hi everyone who is just coming in. So, I want you a quick introduction once we hit 12 p.m. sharp. But in the meantime, just get set up, water bottle, towel, yoga mat, and then you're good to go. All right, so for everybody who's new to our event, welcome once again. This is our Together We Set event. So 24 hours, seven cities, seven different studios around the world. This is your second workout. 
as a series of seven. So hi everyone from Singapore. All right, 60 seconds. All right, I see a lot of GZ people up here. Hello. Are you ready? All right, just about time to go. Yeah, so if you have music, your favorite workout playlist, make sure you're blasting some tunes. I think it really helps help you keep the pace, help you keep you motivated. So just turn that music up. Anything is good. All genres, all good. All right, and it is 12 p.m. So hi, everyone. Hope you guys are doing good and staying safe wherever you are at. Thank you so much for being a part of the Together Set. I'm Anita from Grand here in Singapore, and I will be leaving you guys today after burn. Usually, I teach resistance classes at our studio in the CBD, but this will be our studio for today. So I hope you guys are ready for a fast-paced 45 minutes. Afterburn is a bodyweight-only program that uses varying levels of intensity and different modes of exercise. Our focus here will be on power, endurance, and control. So in your workout, you can expect explosive plyometric exercises, full-body compound movements, as well as time under tension sets for a full body burn. There will be options for all levels, so you can take this as a fun way to get moving, or you can use it as a test for your limit. All you need is your yoga mat, your towel, and your favorite workout playlist. So whether on Spotify or iTunes, make sure you have some awesome music on to accompany your workout. So how about I just give you a brief run through of the format for today. Afterburn consists of four parts separated by a one minute water break in between. So every part has a different intention as well as a different work type. I will be leading you guys through two different base formats today. You have your EMOM every minute on the minute as well as your MREP, as many reps as possible. But no worries, I will go through every part of you in more details right before we take off. Yep, and if you can see on the chat, the workout will be uploaded over here. Just so, so in case you need a reference, you can just hit on there and check it out. All right, so now that people have started to tune in, I'll wait a couple more minutes and then we can start with our warm up. So make sure you're all set up. Yoga mat, towel, water, music, and that's it. Okay, so I'll start the warm up in about 15 seconds. So make sure that you guys have that music turned all the way up. All right, get ready. Your first exercise, you have your jumping jack starting in three, two, one. All right, so let's go. Hands above your head, let's go out and in. Here you want to start getting that blood pumping, get your heart rate going up. A few more in three, two, one. Next off, you have your glute kick. So hands behind your back, shoulders tall. Make sure you pull your heel into your glute. Moving fast. In three, two, one. All right, so pick up those knees. You have your high knees. So engage your core here. Drive your knees up to the ceiling. You have your air squats coming up in three, two, one. So shoulders pulled back, squatting down low, pushing up. You're going to make sure your knees and toes are tracking in the same line. Keep that chest tall. So make sure you're pushing right through midfoot here. All right, into your high plank for mountain climbers in three, two, one. Hands on the mat, shoulders forward. You want to drive your knees up to your elbows. Remember, stay in that high plank position. Wrists, elbows, shoulders, all in one straight line. In three, two, one, we have your push-ups. So you're going to bring your chest to the floor, push your body away, keeping that core tight. If you need to work on your knees, then it's fine too. Just make sure that your shoulders and hips stay in one straight line. 
All right, coming up for your white mountain climbers in three, two, one. Leg comes up to the side. Gonna twist your body to the sky. Open up your hips. Open up your shoulders. That's right, get that stretch in there. All the way up, look at your fingertips as they reach for the sky. In three, two, one. Now you have your interim. So from that high plank, walk your hands in towards your legs. Stand tall. And then walk your hands all the way out to that high plank. High plank. Back to interim. Standing tall. All right, two more of these. And then you are down for your last warm-up exercise. You have your burpees. In three, two, one. All right, let's get it. So... Full body, chest to the floor, bring your feet in, jump up high. For something of a lower intensity, you can just do out, in, jump up, no need to add in that push up, but I encourage you guys to go for that full range of motion. In three, two, one. All right, and time. Whew. So that was your workout. Oh, so that was your warm up. Sorry, workout. That was just your warm up. Now we will start with your part number one. So part one is the imam every minute on the minute. This means that you are working for nine minutes in this imam. Every minute, 60 seconds, you complete two exercises, one after the other. Once you're finished, whatever time is left in that minute, that is your mini break. So every single time that timer goes, you will complete another set. So three pairs, two exercises per pair. You repeat these three supersets three times for a total of nine minutes. So no worries, I will lead you guys through everything and I will also provide modifications if needed. All right, so you guys get ready soon. For your first one, you have your three quarter burpees and your cross mountain climbers. So that will be your first superset imam. So you got 15 reps, three quarter burpees, so serious quarter burpees, gonna come out, shoot your legs up and in. That is your three quarter burpee. For your second exercise, you have your cross body mountain climbers. So in that high plank, shoulders forward, drive your knee to the opposite elbow, just like so. You have 20 on each side. All right, so get ready. You will start your first minute in three, two, one. All right, let's get it. So you have 15 three quarter burpees, chest up tall, Make sure your hips tilt down, the chest comes up. Get low in that squat. So 15 of these, and then you're gonna switch right into cross body mountain climbers. Your goal is to finish these two exercises in 60 seconds. All right now, let's go cross body mountain climbers. So 20 on each side, 40 reps in total. All right, you got 20 seconds left. So for those who are already done, for the next one, you have your side to side push up and then followed by your lateral shoot through. 10 seconds. So side to side push up, out to the side, out here, lateral shoot through, tap, tap, 12 each. All right, in three, two, one, let's go. So side to side push up, hands to the floor, hands in the center, coming out and in. Down and up. If you need to regress on your knees, remember 12 reps. So each side counts as one rep. All right, so once you are ready, once you're finished with that, you have your lateral through through. So from here, take your opposite leg out from a bare plank position. Opposite side, your leg shoots out. Tap and tap. If it's too hard, you just tilt. And tilt, that is fine too. All right, 15 seconds to go. This is your second pair. After this, one more pair coming up. Five seconds. Next up, we have reverse burpee into a reverse lunge with a knee drive. So reverse burpee, eight reps. Coming down, pull your knees in. Here, jump. Knees in, land in the squat and jump. If you guys need a regression, coming down, knees in, use your hands for support. You can push off, 
down and jump. If you want to take out the impact, back, up, squat, that's fine. All right, now we are moving into your reverse lunge knee drive. So shoulders pull back, down, drive up, eight reps on each side. So for this one, you're going to step back, shoulders pull back, step up high, you have eight reps on each side. You're going to change legs. 15 seconds. All right, looking good. Come on, stay strong. You have about 10 seconds before I repeat these three exercises. So three pairs, three times. In three, two, one. All right, back to those three quarter bodies. And in, come up. Make sure you tilt the chest forward. Remember, 15 reps. So in your email, the challenge is to really push that limit. You want to complete as fast as you can to get as much of a break as possible. Okay, cross body mountain climbers. Once you're ready, remember, knees driving up to your opposite elbow. Keep your hips low. Can see on each side. All right, nice. Looking good, guys. Stay strong, stay strong. Come on, keep it up. 20 seconds. And we're cross body mountain climbers. 40 reps in total. Opposite knee, opposite elbow. Keep those hips low. 10 seconds. So next up, side to side push up and lateral shoot through. In three, two, one. Right, let's get it. So remember, high plank, chest to the floor, sit, chest to floor, sit. You got 12. And after that, second exercise, lateral shoot through. You also have 12. So come on, push the pace. Work on your knees. That's fine too. Make sure you keep that core tight. All right, so once you guys are ready, lateral shoot through. Remember, you're going to rotate. Kick out. If you can, have that hip tap the mat. If not, it's out to kick. You can kick just like so. Whatever works for you. Challenging that mobility, remember, keep that core tight. 12 reps only. All right, just 10 seconds left. Woo. Next up, you have your reverse body to a reverse lunge, knee drive. Eight reps total. So reverse body, eight reps. Knees in, land, jump. Take out the jump or use your hands to support whatever works for you if you want to be good. But if you can, push that limit. Sometimes I find if you want to take on the impact from here and tiptoe, that's also fine. All right, get ready for that reverse lunge to knee drive. Once you're ready, down, drive up, just like so. Eight on each leg. You can switch halfway. You can switch once you complete all on one leg. I leave it up to you. I'm going to step back. Drive up. If you want to add in a hop, no hop, just drive. That's also fine. There are options for everyone. 10 seconds. All right. After this, your last round of your three super sets. Three minutes left in your email. Three, two, one. All right, let's get it. Three quarter body. Out, in, tilt, back down. 15 reps. Hustle through. After this, 20 each side, cross body mountain climbers. Come on, let's get it. Shoot out, in, up, down. Once you're ready, cross body mountain climbers. Legs go up to meet the elbow. If you want to do regular mountain climbers, take it slow. Just keep on working as much as you can. That's right, that's right, run it out. Last time in this super set. All right, 10 seconds left. Next up, you have one minute, side to side push up and lateral shoot through. Five seconds. In three, two, one. Side to side push up, remember, coming out to the side, big push up, back in the middle, out to the side. That was two reps. In three, and four, so keep it up until you hit 12.
After this, you have your lateral shoot through. 12 reps as well. All right, once you're ready, lateral shoot through. Back hold position. One leg down, shoot it out, and shoot it out. Try to have your hips tap the floor. 12 in total, six on each side. That's right, stay strong. 15 seconds. All right, 10 seconds to go. You have your final superset in your part number one. Reverse burpee to reverse lunge knee drive. Ready? All right, let's get it. Eight, eight and eight. Move faster. That's right. Pull it in, engage that core. Jump up high, extend. Just keep on moving. All right, if you're ready to burn it out, reverse lunge to knee drive, drive it up, add that hop, whatever works for you. It's right, come on, come on, let's go. Switch legs, don't forget, eight on each side. 20 seconds. Chest tall. All right, come on, make it through, you have 10 seconds. That's right, keep on moving. Five, in three, two, one, and break. All right. Whew. So that was your first EMOM, part number one. Next up, you have part number two. It's a 10 minute M rep. All right, I gotta get some water, but I will explain everything to you guys. Remember, water, towel down, drink up. Whew. It's so hot, but I love it. All right, just about half into our break. So now I'll explain to you your MRAP. So for your MRAP, you have five exercises. So MRAP means as many reps as possible. In these 45 seconds, you got 45 seconds on, 15 seconds off, 10 minutes of this. So five exercises. First one, you got your reverse back row. So forward to reverse back row, first exercise. So in the break, so I will go to exercises first. So first exercise, forward to reverse back row. Try to move your opposite hand, opposite leg. 45 seconds of work, 15 seconds of rest. Second one, squat hold to reverse lunge. So staying low in that squat, coming out. Make sure your shoulders are pulled back, staying low in that squat. Down, up, step back, lunge, up, lunge, and up. That is your second exercise. Next up, push up, shoulder tap. So in that high plank, push up, shoulder tap, push up, and shoulder tap. One tap, one push up. If you have to work on your knees, regress. Down on your toes, up on your knees, reset, tap, tap. All right, for fun, you have your kneel to squat jump. So watch carefully. If you have a towel, you can place it under your neck for extra cushioning. So chest tall. Two steps up to a squat, jump, back down to a kneel. So one side knee at one time. Jump and back down. Last one, single leg glute bridge. So pretty classic. Onto your back, hands on the floor for support, my leg up, pushing up, coming down, up and down. You switch halfway. All right, we will start in five seconds. So everybody get ready and rep. 45 seconds on, 15 seconds off. First exercise, forward and reverse back off. Ready? In three, two, one. All right, let's go. So in that back off position, crawling forward and back. Make sure you keep your hips low. Going to move opposite hand, opposite shoulder. A lot of core control here. In your end reps, you go for as many reps as possible in these 45 seconds. That's right, forward and back. So if you have more space, you guys can actually go as far as you can really to keep within that yoga mat. But if you are working in a tight space, it's all good. All right, you got five. Three, two, one. All right, 15 seconds of rest. Next up, squat, hold, reverse lunge. Stay low, lunge, up, lunge, up. 
get ready. So you really want to think about pulling those shoulders back. Three, two, one, let's go. Down into that squat, tap your knee, hold that squat, tap your knee, hold it. So here, time under tension. You are okay, always keeping that tension in your quads, in your glutes as you tap. Keep those shoulders up, chest tall. Come on, stick it out. More than halfway. Remember, shoulders back, staying low, down, up, down, up. If this is difficult, you can do a pulse here for as long as you can. Side to side, pulse, whatever works. Just try to make sure you keep that tension in your legs. In three, two, one. All right, starting in three, two, one. Let's go. In that high plank, one push up, one shoulder tap if you can. If you're gonna work on those push ups, down on your toes, up on your knees, reset, tap, tap. So it's down, up, tap, tap. If you can go for the full one, one down, one tap, one down, and tap. Just remember, in your push ups, Hips and shoulders stay in one straight line. You're always engaging the core. All right, 10 seconds. Up. That's right, come on, five. Three, two, and one. All right, next up, fourth exercise, kneel to squat jump. So remember, if you have a towel, you want some extra cushioning on your knees, you can fold it into quarters, use it to the Pushing your knees as you do it. Starting in three, two, one. Starting in your new position. Left foot deep, coming up, squat, jump. Left foot again, coming down, and just like so. So halfway through, you will switch that leading leg. Almost halfway. So for those who need a regression, all your knees hurt. You can do, you can do, down, up. Down, down, up, and just stick up the pace. Add in the jump, and then whatever you want. But if you can, for your motion, stay low in that squat, jump up high, like down, and up. Five. In three, two, one. All right. Hit exercise. So last exercise in this end right. I'm repeating this two times, by the way. Two rounds of five. Single leg glute bridge. The finger sit halfway, hands on the floor for support, hips up high, come down, push it up. You don't want to push the hips up towards the ceiling, down, up. If you want to work both legs, that's fine too. You go toes up, push that through, come down, push up, and down. So, one, two, up, one, two, down, push, tap, up, down, push. All right, stay strong, you got 10 seconds. Pop those hips up. Almost to the end. In three, two, one. All right, those are your five exercises. You keep everything one more time. You are halfway through your end rep. So 10 minutes, this is next five. Back to the first one. In three, two, one. Go to back roll. So stay in that back position, opposite leg, reach, and coming back. So try to keep your hips in the shoulders the whole time, looking far. Nice, come on, push it out. All the way. You guys are past it halfway up in your afterburn for today. 10 seconds. In three, two, one. All right, next up, squat, hold, reverse lunge. Come on, you only have four more sets left. You got this. Check it out, five seconds. In three, two, one, let's go. Hold that squat, one leg tap back, joining the other, hips stay low, 
feel that tension throughout your leg. That's right. I always want to see those shoulders put back, chest is tall. Nice. If you want options over here, what you can do, just do pulses, keep your hands out. Or if you want to keep on moving, you can do a pulse, pulse, move, up, pulse, move, back up. If not, you stay low, out, in, and out. Constant tension. That's right, that's right. Three, two, and one. All right, shake your legs out. Push up, shoulder tap. Oh, my heart is racing right now. Three seconds. In three, two, one. Push up, shoulder tap. Up, tap, tap. So on that tap, a lot of times when people tap, they tend to come up all the way. I want you guys to keep steady. Barely move in that tap. Nice. Working on your knees, fine too. Down on your toes, up on your knees, reset, tap, and tap. This is about stability, so don't rush. Tap. And tap. 10 seconds. Five. And time. All right. Two more exercises. Next one, kneel to squat jump. So if you need a towel, place it under your knees, starting from here. One leg leads. Up, same leg comes down. In three, two, one. This high leading is the right. Jumping up high and down. Hold that squat, jump up high, back to kneel. Always keeping those shoulders facing forward. Nice. Remember option here. You can just do a pulse, up, but try to keep moving fast. All right, halfway. Now we are switching sides, leading with the left. Left leg comes up, hold and jump. Left leg goes down, and again. Ten. All right, five seconds. You got this. Keep it up. Three, two, one. We are in your final exercise, single leg glute bridge. So 45 seconds only. Remember, if you want to let that heart rate settle a bit, push it into your glutes, hips up. Three, two, one. Tap, push, tap, and push. Make sure you make it explosive. Up. Two legs, fine two. Just make sure to push it up all the way. Go down, faster. Slow down, press up. All right. In three, two, one, you're switching legs. Up, down, push up, and down. That's right. Come on, stay strong. All the way through those glutes. Hips up. In five. In three, two, one. All right, get is it that was your m rep you have two more parts five minutes per part nick so you only have 10 minutes left of work for today all right i'm going to take it off drink up i need water too all right so next up you have another imam every minute on the minute so this means for five minutes you go through four exercises per minute you have your burpee squat jump plank jack cryo lunge so in 60 seconds you will complete four burpees 10 jump squats 10 plank jacks and 10 plyo lunges so this demo for you burpee chest to floor if you can all day after you've done four of these you have 10 jump squats so coming down low, keep you to the ground. If you want to do air squats, that's fine too. 10 of these. After that, plank jack. High plank, legs go out and in. Just 10 reps. Last one, pile lunge. So shoulders pull back. Explosive movements here. You are staying light on your feet. 10 in total. 60 seconds, four exercises. Repeat for five minutes. 
All right, you have about 15 seconds left. All right, how's everyone doing? Doing good? All right, starting soon. Five seconds, remember, 60 seconds of work, four exercises back to back to back to back. After that, you rest for a mini break, repeat five times. Ready in five seconds. In three, two, one. So full body, chest to floor, legs back in, thumb up, hands above your hips, back down. In, up, four of these. If you want to regress, you can do out, in, jump, so that's fine too. Once you've done a four, you got 10 jump squats. Down, up, down, up, sprint it through. Come on, get low. That's right, 10 of these. If you want to, air squats, just fine. Burn it out. After that, plank cock. Into your high plank, 10 reps here. Shoulder forward all the way. Bend it up, bend it up. Then you hit the pile land. Shoulder pull back. Stay light on your feet. If you want to, you can just do a reverse lunge. 10 in total, five on each side. Just five minutes here. All right. Whew. 10 minutes left. Everyone doing good? Nice. All right, five seconds, next round. Buffy, jump squats, plank hops, and let's go. So chest to floor, step up high, option, out, in, reach, out, in, reach. Once you're done with four, quad jumps. That's right, legs come off, shoulders, try not to collapse the chest, pull back into that squat, yep. Air squats just fine. Plank hops. Let's try shoulders forward. And then higher lunge. Light on your feet. Standing tall. Whew. Three rounds. Three rounds left. Walk it out if you need to recover. Five seconds. In three, two, one. Chest to floor. Pull your legs in. Jump up high. Remember, you can take out the push out. Out, in, reach. Out, in, reach. Jump squat. So you can see, for my jump squats, I'm coming down all the way, chest up tall. You can do air squats, that's fine too. Just keep on moving. All right, hang up. Burn it up, this way you can go fast. Last one, high lunges. Let's go. Whew. Okay, two sets, two more rounds. You are almost at the end. Whew. Five seconds. In three, two, one, let's go. Burpees. Amazing full body exercise here. Remember, option, take out that push up. Next one, jump squats, air squats, whatever you want. Just make sure you get low. Moving fast. Thank you. Arms are stacked. Core is tight. Going fast. All right, how are you guys? Higher lunge. Remember, you can step back. You can jump. Just stay light on your feet. Shoulders always up. Okay, last set. Five seconds. In three, two, one, let's go. Burpees. Four burpees, 10 of the rest. So jump squats, air squats. Just keep that chest up, coming down low. Feel it in your legs. Full extension, yep. Plank up. 
shoulders forward, out and in. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, how you lunge? Let's get it. <sighs> okay, come on. 15 seconds left. You want to go all the way. If you can finish before, finish before. If you can go all the way to the end, just go and see you can't stop. Come on, counting down for you. You got five, three, two, one. Time. Okay. Whew. All the hard stuff is done. Now you have five minutes of core. So abs, lower back, whole core from here all the way to the back. You got five minutes to make it a holistic workout. Everything combined. So 10 exercises, 30 seconds each, five minutes, non-stop. This is part number four. 30 seconds. This is the easy part. You have five minutes of car, that's it. 15 seconds. All right, so get ready. You are starting with your V-up, starting on your back, and then slowly you're going to flip over. So 10 exercises, I will need you guys to. First start, you have your V-up. Ready? 30 seconds of V-up. Three, two, one. Bring down, up, and up. So if you can, have your upper body and lower body crunch up towards the side at the same time. If you have to take a break, you can let your feet drop. But if not, I encourage you, don't let your toes touch the floor. 10. Here is your time to take it slow. Don't brush these reps. Next up, single leg crunch in three, two, one. Oh, sorry, straight leg crunch. So Feet in the air, reach for your toes. On the way up, breathe up. Just like so. Breathe up as you crunch. Nice, nice, keep it up. 10 seconds. Next up, you have your leg lift, classic leg lift. Three, two, one. So for your leg lift, have your hands up, shoulder blades off the mat. Pop them up, bring it down, pop it up just like so. If your lower back is starting to hurt or to lift off the mat, hands in a diamond under your tailbone, drop, let those toes hover, bring up and drop, up and drop, 90 degrees only. 10 seconds. If you can, hollow hold, shoulder blade off the mat. Nice, coming into flutter kick. Three, Two, one. So from here, shoulder blades up. You are gonna run it out. Shoulder blade off the mat. If your lower back hurts, hands in a diamond under your table for support. Looking at your toes as you sprint. So run away with those legs. Halfway. Let's go, let's go. Five, three, two, one. Bicycle crunch. From here. Opposite shoulder goes up to opposite knee. Try not to pull like this. Keep your shoulder blades off. Shoulder to knee, not elbow to knee. That's right, legs out all the way. 10 seconds. After this, you are flipping over onto your back. Five more. Three, two, one. Lipping over, you have your swimmers. So coming down here, just like so, swim it out. Activate your back muscles here. That's right, that's right. Arm straight if you can. If this is too difficult, what you can do, just take it slow. This is good too. If it's too intense, if not, swim it out with me. Five. In three, two, one. All right, you're coming into your high plank. So high plank, you have your cross crunch. Opposite knee, opposite elbow. High plank, cross. High plank, cross. So I'll show you from the front. Opposite knee, opposite elbow. Just go slow, let it burn. Yep, get those obliques. 10 seconds.
three, two, one. From here, dropping into that low plank. So hips and shoulders, one straight line. Elbows and shoulders, one straight line. That's right. Just breathe. Control. You are in control here. Halfway. Yep, stay with me. You have less than 10 seconds. After this, two more exercises, you're done. One minute left. Three, two, one. All right, Russian twist. Flipping over, legs lifted off the mat. Gonna tap the floor side to side. Here, you're gonna engage your oblique, keep your shoulders pulled back. If you have to, and keep your feet on the floor and tap. But if you can, I want you to lift those feet up and go together. 10 seconds. Come on, one on each side. In three, two, one. All right, last exercise, box the sit up. So have your hands behind you, out and in, just like so. Hands on the floor for support. Drive your knees in towards your chest. You have 20 seconds. Come on, don't stop here. I know you have it. 15. Out, in, out. Core tight, chest up. 10. Come on, guys, bring it out. In five, in three, two, one, and time. Whew. All right. That was your afterburn. Good job, guys. So now I have a quick two minute cool down. Let that heart rate settle. Stretch it out for a bit. So you can stay standing up, seated it down, whatever works for you. Just let the heart rate settle. First step, you're going to stretch out your arm. So arm across your body. You can cross at your wrist or your elbow. Feel the stretch. Just let that heart rate settle. Let those muscles relax. In three, two, one. Same hand up and over, holding on to the elbow. Give your shoulder girdle a nice stretch. All right, you guys did so good. Awesome work, everyone. In three, two, one, switching sides. So again, crossing at the wrist or at the elbow, whichever feels better for you. Stretch it out. In three, two, one. Up and over, right over here. In three, two, one. All right, so coming up to standing, find the wall for support. You're going to pick your heel up over here, stretching out the front of your legs, stretching out your quad muscles. That's right. Give your legs a hard run today. In three, two, one, sit. So on to the other side. If you can stay, no support, that's fine too. Just keep the chest up. Breathe in and out and relax. Yep, remember? Heel all the way into your group. In three, two, one. All right, let's come down into your high plank, wide mountain climber. We're gonna drop that knee over here. If you can, drop the elbows, get deep into the stretch. In three, two, one. So on that same leg, you're gonna push your hips back, stretch out your hamstring on this side. Bring your chest as close as you can to your knee. So close your eyes. Breathe in. And when you breathe out, I want you to think about letting the breath go right through your leg. Send it through those muscles. Three, two, one. Switching sides. Up over here. Drop your knee. Drop your elbow. Get deep into the stretch. In three, two, one. On this side, hips back, toe to the sky, chest to your knee, looking down. Okay, shoulders reach forward. Oh, feel the stretch. Three, two, one. All right, so return to your high plank. From here, on to the floor, you walk your hands in towards your legs. Okay, let's hang out here for a second. So from here, feel that stretch all the way through your legs. 
holding on the elbows, sway from side to side. Let your head drop, let everything go. Three deep breaths, in and out, in, out. All right, last one. So deep breath at the bottom. Hold it in as you rise to the top. All right, hands all the way to the sky and let it out. That was the afternoon. Thank you so much, everyone. Whew. I hope you guys had as much fun as I did. I had an amazing time splashing it up with you guys. You all crushed it. So I'm Anita from Ground Zero in Singapore. You can check Ground Zero out and give us a follow at Ground Zero SG on Instagram. And do check out Class Pass as well for some awesome content and amazing ideas to keep on moving anytime, anywhere. So right now we have five more studios coming up in our Together We Set event. Next up, we have the platform from Dubai. So if you guys want to go for a round number two, stay tuned in a couple of hours. Thank you so much for being a part of this global fitness event. Remember to tag us at Together We Sweat so we can share all your posts. All right. Thanks so much. Hey, everyone. I see you guys. Whew. All right. So stay safe, okay? I will see you guys real soon, whether it's in the studio, online, or wherever. All right. Thanks so much. Hope you guys had as much fun as me. I liked it. <laughs> All right, thank you. Bye, everyone. Goodbye from Singapore.